Daniel Radcliffe has reflected on how he deals with fans telling him they think he was ST in Harry Potter as he posed up a storm in a magazine photo shoot. The actor, 33, admitted he gets fans telling him their brutally honest opinions on the Wizarding franchise, but said he refuses to agree with them. He told GQ magazine that fans have said to him Harry Potter was ST, adding that he believes people think they will be closer with him if they share their unflinching opinions. Explaining how he reacts to the comments, he told the publication, You can feel that, but I'm not gonna be like, yeah, man, it was 10 years of my life. Daniel went on to reflect on what it was like being thrown into the limelight when he was cast as Harry Potter at the age of 11, saying it took him a long time to grasp how it would change his life. When asked how long it took him to come to grips with his global fame, he said, it took a long time, is what I'm saying. But my late teens or early 20s was where I was like, you have to accept life is gonna be different for you. He said he came to the realization when he was growing up that he had to think about how people were aware of him, saying it became easier to adapt to with time. As well as speaking about Harry Potter, Daniel also posed up a storm in a stylish photoshoot with GQ magazine. The Lost City star kept it casual in orange trousers and a multicolored striped turtleneck jumper, which he styled with red trainers. He held an accordion for the photoshoot as he channeled American singer Weird Al Yankovic, who he has starred as in Eric Appel fully authorized satirical biographical parody film. Weird, the Al Yankovic story premieres on November 4 and sees Daniel transforms into a hard partying version of five-time Grammy winner, who made a career crafting parodies of hit songs. Daniel's characterization of the star is a far cry from the real 62-year-old, who is a wholesome, long-time vegetarian who abstained from profanity, alcohol, and drugs. Speaking to GQ about the role, Daniel said he was really excited when he was approached for the project and was able to do something so f-king crazy. Daniel also admitted that he is a fitness fanatic in real life as he addressed his muscular appearance in the upcoming film. He also said the project was the quickest thing he has ever worked on as they finished filming after just 18 days. His comments come after the full trailer for Weird, the Al Yankovic story was revealed in August. In one fantastical scene, Weird Al is visited at his palatial Beverly Hills mansion by Queen of Pop Madonna, who asks him if he'll make a parody of her 1984 hit Like a Virgin. I'm curious, is that song autobiographical? Yankovic asked. Madonna, played by Evan Rachel Wood, then replied, Yes, except for the fact that I've had a lot of sex. Weird Al and Madonna are then seen passionately making out against his wall in the scene. In real life, it's unclear if the pair ever physically met, but Madonna did tell an acquaintance of his manager Jay Levy that she wanted Yankovic's parody to be called like a surgeon. The fantasy continues as Madonna becomes a bad influence on Weird Al as they are trailed by fans and paparazzi. Yankovic is later seen performing his 1985 parody Like a Surgeon on stage while flanked by two Jean Paul Gaudier Cohn bra clad backup dancers from Madonna's Blonde Ambition Tour in 1990. Historically, most artists considered it a rite of passage to get parodied by the polka loving star and those who didn't live to regret it. Read the full feature in the November issue of British GQ now available on newsstands.